2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. The city of Dallas, Texas. The location for the Bucks. He is what you never want to see coming at you at full speed in the open floor. The Great Freak, Giannis Antetokounmpo. He leads his team tonight as they prepare to get down to business at American Airlines Arena. Bucks, man, up next. Welcome, folks. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for the latest presentation of our NBA basketball. I'm Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony, Hall of Famer Doris Burke, and another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, from the sidelines. A moment now to check out some numbers for Chris Stapps Porzingis. And guys, it hasn't been pretty for him in the past five games. He's having one of those scoring slumps that all players go through at some point in the season. But I know he hadn't lost his confidence, and I expect this young man to get after it here tonight. And with pregame routines coming to an end, we're just about ready for our tip-off. First, though, let's get a report from the sideline and say hello to David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin. Jeru Holiday is in his eighth season with the Pelicans. He said, I've been here the longest with the possible exception of the security guard. There was a ball boy who was here before me, but now he's one of our coaches. Kevin, he's still all in and trying to help the Big Easy get back to the playoffs. Terrific. David, thanks. Greg, tonight's game, like so many, could come down to the three-point shooting. There are debates as to whether that style alone can win you a championship. What do you think? You know, there will never be a substitute for balance, but I just think with the evolution of the skill that we see in that game, the coaches and players being so smart, you do want to keep the opponents guessing, but let's face it, the three-point shot is here to stay. It's really simple math. Three is more than two. Here are the starters for Milwaukee. Middleton and Giannis are the forward tandem. Dante DiVincenzo, he's out there with Holiday. And it's Lopez in at the five, roaming the paint. And for the Mavericks, Kleba is... ...the four with Porzingis in the middle. Doncic out there with Richardson. And it's Finney Smith in at the three, the small forward. What a basketball mind when you think about Luka Doncic. This guy in the break is exploiting defenses. And they double up on a Dekumbo. The shot by Middleton, wide open. No good with the triple. And so it's Perzingis. He'll bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Here's Kleba. And a miss there on the triple. And now here comes on Dekumbo leading the break. The shot, no good. Porzingis with the ball, out guarded by Giannis. Here's Doncic, the good-looking shot from the wing. See, Porzingis should score the basketball, but he also recognizes when his teammates have a clean look. I love that on selfishness. Now here's Middleton. He's coming off a 28-point game against Golden State. And let's not forget about the assist. This guy is a playmaker, was a driving force for that offense. And this is what you want on both ends to win the battle of effort. And that's exactly what you can control, right? Your desire, your hustle, your will to succeed. And the wide open shot from DiVincenzo. <laughs> and a great assist by Antetokounmpo as that one goes in. And I tell you, Antetokounmpo has evolved into one of the better passing forwards in our league. And when the defense is focused on you that much, you need to be able to find the open man. 80% from the field to start, playing with a ton of confidence. And Holiday kicks to Antetokounmpo. Kleba with the rebound. For Dallas, they've gone 4-5 of five from the field so far. And we heard Shaquille O'Neal bestow his Superman nickname on Giannis Antetokounmpo, and rightfully so. The Greek freak, the most dominant paint scorer since Shaq himself. And here's Holiday following Porzingis' three. Well, tremendous defensive effort on the interior. That's the kind of contest you want. 
Doncic with the bucket. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. And here in the first, approaching three minutes played. And watching Antetokounmpo get to the rim, can G.A. take your breath away? <laughs> Man, he can go around you, through you, or literally jump right over you. Call him the freak, Superman, what have you. None of it feels like an exaggeration.